We have two balls, blue and red. Mickey, who are you voting for? The blue team or the red team? Pick wisely. Really? You want for the blue team? Huh? But your favorite color is red. Recount. Are we window watching during election day? Yes, we are. Who are we voting for? It's election day, Mickey. Look, it's election day. Who's gonna win? Huh? Let the dog decide. Blue or red? Go! Hey guys, thank you for coming by uh, on a special uh, question and answer video. Mickey, how are you doing today, huh? So excited. Thank you very much. And before we get started with this Q&A, I want to announce the winners of the giveaway. You know, there were some questions that we had before about Mickey. And one of the questions was, how much did Mickey wait during the time two months ago? Uh, the winner was Mickey K, who said seven pounds. Mickey was seven and a half pounds at that time without going over and pretty much he wanted a giveaway. KDA is uh, another winner who actually answered the questions uh, regarding uh, Mickey's favorite color. What was Mickey's mother's main name and what was her favorite color which was red and Mickey's mom was called Minerva. And for the winners for the, for the giveaway, we have a brand new Mickey face mask that have been used. And we also have an awesome t-shirt. This was actually donated by Jess from Hawaii. It's a, called the Kill the Virus t-shirt. The spray can is a representation of Lysol can and the Kill the COVID-19 virus. So that's actually a pretty cool, uh, a pretty, pretty cool shirt. The first question that we got from uh, on the YouTube channel, uh, GK Notes asks us, what is Mickey's birthday? Well, Mickey was born on February 22nd of 2020. So we're approaching eight months now. Uh, and then, um, what was, is there any special reason why you named her Mickey? Well, uh, we followed the Chinese Zodiac. And uh, so me and my wife were thinking, what's the most famous mouse out there? There is. And the first thing we came up with was Mickey Mouse. So we came up with Mickey, but we want to add a little Asian flair to it. So we decided to do the Japanese version of it, which is Mickey, which means bold and beautiful in Japanese. So that's how Mickey got her name. Hi Mickey. Okay. The question was by Virginia Richardson. And the question was what she's like when she's angry. Mickey doesn't really get angry often. Uh, she really gets angry. She's more happy than anything else. She never barks. That's the thing too. Uh, when she does get angry, it's probably from some toys. Angry at her own toys. But yeah, she's never really angry though. She's a great dog. Hey Mickey. Uh, next question is by Lifetime Travel Weights. And the question was, hey Mickey, who do you enjoy spending more time with, mom or dad? You know what, she spends more time at home with mommy while uh, daddy's outside uh, looking for work and something like that. So I think she loves my, make, uh, mommy more. She does, you know, uh, uh, she's more attached to mommy because when Mickey went home to us, mommy was the one that she took care of her and hold, hold her in her arms when we we're going home. So that's the kind of reason why Mickey's more attached to mommy. Snowflake, Mossy and me, uh, how often do you clip Mickey's nails? Uh, I think we tend to do it once every week and a half or two weeks. Um, we don't trim often, we also go to the groomer to do it too. But yeah, um, I think once every two weeks. But Tima Aguilar asks, why does she have to be so cute all the time? She's so cute. 
Yes, she's definitely a cute puppy. We're just so glad to have her. She's everything to us, right, Mickey? This next question is by Vipav Satija. I'm sorry if I mispronounced your name, but the question is, do you have a video with her which is angry? Uh, Mickey doesn't really get angry often, but look back at the eight weeks to eight months video. There's a, a, pic, uh, a video of her getting angry at the minion. <laughs> uh, who grooms her? Uh, we have a groomer uh, by the name of Tina. She does a really good job and she's very close by. It's pet grooming by Tina. Uh, next question is by Coleman Mustard. Uh, what film director would you like to work with after you, you're rewarded the next year's Oscar? Mickey, who do you want to work with? We like Steven Spielberg. We like uh, certain people too. Mickey, that's my big Mick. There you go, Mickey. Uh, who do you think, uh, do you think your ridiculousness, good looks, somehow lessen your chances of being taken seriously by the Kennedy? Maybe so, right, Mickey? You might just get the Oscar for just being cute. What is, uh, Yogesh Dora asks, what's the age of this sweetie pot animal? She's currently 8 months old and 2 weeks. Uh, Jody Fami asks, what is Mickey's favorite thing to do? She likes to eat, she loves to sleep, and she loves to play fetch with us. That's what she. That's her favorite activities: play fetch, be active with her parents. Pooja Kira asks, "What's her favorite food?" You know what? She likes peas and carrots. She likes chicken breasts. Uh, she's a huge fan of blueberries. She loves blueberries. Right, Mickey? Yeah. So we move on to our next location, Mickey's favorite spot to do the Q and A interview. Uh, next question was by Dennis Chen. What was um uh, will Mickey have her babies? Uh, we're planning not to have babies for Mickey. Um, I want her to have a healthy life, and by reducing the chances, uh, we plan to get her fixed soon. Uh, you know that will help with uh, lesser chance with cancer or any other diseases as well too. So yeah, we plan to keep her as is. Now we'll not have babies for her though. And this question is by Erica Herzoni. What is Darling's favorite? Uh, what is, what's her favorite food? Uh, I think I answered that earlier. Uh, favorite food is chicken, peas and carrots. Uh, she loves uh, blueberries, raspberries too, and strawberries. Yeah. Next question is by Emiliko. Um, was it hard to potty train her? Uh, well, it wasn't hard at all. When Mickey was eight weeks old, when she came home to us, she got it on the first try, actually, on the very first try. I think our reader kind of prepared her as well, too. And when she came home, she went straight to the pee pads, and she knew exactly where to go. She does have some um, accidents here and there that's very normal for puppies, but other than that, um, just being, being patient, and she actually does it very well. And the next question also was, uh, what's the first tip that you would give someone, a person, uh, that's kind of get a shish situation, judging by your experience with Mickey? Uh, my first tip would be definitely do your research first. Uh, go on Google, go on YouTube, you know, check out their characteristics, their, their traits, their personality. See if it's the right dog for you, that's for sure. And uh, if you are planning to get a shish uh, training is very important, so make sure that uh, you have the time to do it, the patience, because those are two most important things. Um, don't ever leave your shishu alone, especially when they're this small. So those are my advice and tips that you should do first. Questions by Elena Mega. Have you ever thought about turning her into a show doll like her mom? I think the time and maintenance to keep her coat cool, nice and silky and shiny is, seems like it is a lot of work. And uh, do I want to keep her show dog? Maybe, but I think I just want her to be happy and have an enjoyable life. So probably not. I'm planning to make, make her a show dog. Sure, the big her the basic tricks and to sit, lay down, roll over, the tricks like that. Yes, we uh, she think he knows how to. Do the handshake, Mickey knows how to sit, lay down. Uh, we're teaching her how to stand right now. Uh, I just teach her basic commands. I think it's the most important that we be right. Mickey Dara asks, uh, 
Uh, Mickey's a very cute dog. I have a Shih Tzu as well too. My question is, Mickey's gender, Mickey's a girl. And Mickey's favorite food, I think we answered that. Blueberries, chicken, uh, strawberries, he's a carrot. Sheila Inzi asks, how long did it take you to potty train Mickey? Uh, like I said, uh, the first week she got on the spot, but to be consistent with no accidents, uh, the first two months, I would say the first two months was finally she finally got the point. Uh, not to poo here or pee here. My advice to everyone, every owner is to remove all your rugs. Anything that kind of shows that uh, a carpet, anything that kind of shows her that's kind of similar to a pee pad, get it removed. It actually helps a lot. I can't pronounce his name, doesn't mean it's in Chinese, but uh, does Mickey drink milk? Uh, Mickey doesn't drink milk. Um, only because some dogs are lactose intolerant, so we're not a big milk to see the react. Well, that's it for the Q and A. Uh, thank you for all the questions regarding Mickey. Uh, really appreciate. Uh, we're at episode twelve right now, and so yeah. Um, if you have any other questions for a future Q and A, make sure to do and put it down below in the comments. For all the new viewers out there, make sure to subscribe the channel, give the video a thumbs up. That's very important for Nikki, right Nikki? So yeah, I see you guys next time and yes, peace out.